Most of these videos, people are like, Leeds, Birmingham, Liverpool, all these stats and data and all the rest of it. Oh my God, this can stop people from freaking investing. My team constantly asking me, what are the five best areas? Oh, here's the top five areas. Planet Earth, planet Earth, planet Earth, planet Earth, planet Earth. <laughs> Freaking anywhere is the best place to invest. All these stats and data and all the rest of it, oh my God, this can stop people from freaking investing. Truth is, there's a strategy that works everywhere and you've got to diversify your strategies. You know, service accommodation works in some places, flips work, little villages. Most of these videos, people are like, Leeds, Birmingham, Liverpool. Listen, you need the villages that no one's freaking heard of. Kegworth, Hathen, Little Over. These are just somewhere, you know, close to me around here, which I know freaking work for flips like a good one. HMOs, basically any town that's not reached their threshold for the Article 4 threshold. Areas to invest in, most of these things, especially the articles and the bog standard stuff out there, most of them are just on, based on capital growth. They've actually got no idea, freaking idea of actually making money. You don't make money from capital growth. That's some long-term shiznits. Anyone can buy a house and just sit on it for 20 years and, and perceive to make money, but that's BS. You know why? Because the money that you put into there, you think that that's what you got. With, but with inflation and all the rest of it, with, especially if you bought it with mortgages and the interest that you you've paid, the maintenance that you've done over that time, you haven't made money. You, you make money when you get cash flow. You make money when you get something called ROI, return on investment. So how do you do that? You've got to go to the places, HMOs, you know, city centers, around large manufacturing places, universities, airports, all of these good things. Like I said, the flips in all the little villages, service accommodation, you've got to know what product it is. Is it holiday lets? Then you've got to go to the holiday locations. Is it construction workers? Is that what you want? like the lease workers, you want that, then you've got to go to the places where all the big projects are happening and where all the people come to commute and need to stay there. Yeah, is it leisure people? Then you've got to go to the most visited cities, the most visited places. Where are the places that people want to stay? That's what service accommodation is. If you want to build new houses, again, that's kind of a flip strategy, or you could be doing new houses to turn them into buy to lets as well, which like what I've done before. Again, you've got to go to those places where that demand is rife. So basically, rather than saying what the best area is, you just got to say, what is the demand? It's not whether there is demand or not. It's like, what is the demand? So if I have a certain strategy, you know, let's say I pick service accommodation, then I go and pick the areas where I know that works. Yeah, if my strategy is doing hotels and resorts, then I've got to pick the area where that strategy works. You know, so doing best five areas, which we've done before and people, loads of people watch it and all the rest of it. But anyway, this is a new flavor on the best areas to invest in 2024.